Now, I typed into ChatGPT what would I do about my mum's kidney disease, and uh, they gave me the answers. And then I said to ChatGPT, um, I think you need, need to rethink your answer because protein does not damage the kidney. In fact, studies show it is protective. Fruit would not be good as the leading cause of kidney disease is diabetes, which is high levels of blood glucose. Fruit and vegetables have no benefit proven. Reducing things like potassium and other minerals could be helpful. And many fruit and veg need to be avoided due to the high levels of certain minerals and oxalates. And ChatGPT said, you raise important points about challenging some conventional dietary requirements. Let me search for more specific information about protein's role and the connection between blood glucose, diabetes, oxalates and kidney disease. And it completely puts everything on its head. And it says the key point is blood glucose control is critical. <laughs> Didn't say that first off. Managing blood glucose is fundamental as diabetes is the leading cause of kidney disease progression. Focus on maintaining stable blood sugar levels through diet and, medi and medication, it says. Uh, then it gives you a protein intake. Quality protein sources like meat, fish and eggs can be protective. It also gives a link. Uh, there's no need to reduce protein drastically or split into multiple meals unless advised by a healthcare professional. See, high quality protein does not damage kidneys and may be protective when blood sugar is controlled. And it gives a link to that. We need to interrogate these things and really, really not take the first answer because, you know, you'll get the wrong answer, sadly.